Welcome to Kokenhof Gardens. Mga kastars, we are on our way to Kokenhof Gardens. Talaga naman, pag nagsasama-sama ang mga Pilipino, hindi lang maingay, kundi sobrang saya pa. Dahil medyo matagal lang aming biyahe, kaya may mga kasamahan kaming tulog. At syempre, marami din ang gising dahil nag-e-enjoy sa travel. Imagine, from Germany to Holland, medyo mahababang biyahe yun. Pero okay na dahil nakatulog naman ng maayos at nakakain din ng masasarap na pagkain sa hotel na aming tinulugan. At ngayon naman, syempre, maraming katuwaan dito on board sa sinasakyan namin bus dahil excited ang lahat makarating sa Kuchenhof Gardens. Alam niyo mga kastars, ang una naming destination galing England was Lords in France. Doon kami muna pumunta. Siyempre, nagpasalamat kay Mama Mary. Pagkatapos na Lords, abyumiyahin naman kami papuntang Germany. Makyat kami papuntang Germany. Ayan, at may tatlo kaming lugar na napuntahan sa Germany. Ang una naming napuntahan was Cologne. Ayan, yung Cologne na ginagamit nating pabango. Brand pala yun ng uh, pabango uh, sa Germany. Ang Cologne ay isang lugar, isang syudad na napakaganda. At sumunod naman, pumunta kaming Solingen. Alam niyo yung brand ng mga utensils na Solingen. Sobrang gaganda. Pumunta kami doon. At yung last namin pinuntahan was yung Dasseldorf. Doon kami nag-sleepover uh, before kami nag-travel going to Holland. Kaya ayun. Kaya medyo mahababang biyahe pero sulit. Now mga kastars, we are officially here at Kuchenhof Gardens. Kuchenhof Kuchenhof, also known as the Garden of Europe, is one of the world's largest flower gardens situated in the town of Lees in the Netherlands. According to the official website, Kuchenhof Park covers an area of 32 hectares and approximately 7 million flower bulbs are planted in the gardens annually. Let's talk about a bit of Kuchenhof's history. In 1949, a group of 20 leading flower bulb growers and exporters came up with a plan to use the estate to exhibit spring flowering bulbs, signaling the birth of Kuchenhof as a spring park. The park opened its gates to the public in 1950 and was an instant success with 236,000 visitors in the first year alone. Though its grounds are open year-round for private affairs and festivals, Kuchenhof is only open to the general public for a world-renowned eight-week tulip display from mid-March to mid-May, with peak viewing arriving near mid-April, depending on growing season weather, which varies annually. Last year, 2019, 1.5 million people visited Kuchenhof equivalent to 26,000 visitors per day. Each fall, 40 gardeners plant the 7 million bulbs donated to the park by over 100 growers. Planting starts early October and is usually completed by December the 5th, round center class, that's Christmas season. The flower beds are synchronized to the different bulb flowerings to ensure blooms throughout the duration of park's eight-week opening. To ensure continuous bloom, three bulbs are planted in each location. The shallowest bulb will bloom first for three weeks, followed by the subsequent layers. Kukino falls under a charitable foundation of Count Karel de Gaff van Linden. 
As of January 1, 2016, the foundation owns both Kuchenhof and Castle Kuchenhof plus the surrounding estate. How about the revenues of Kuchenhof? The Kuchenhof does not receive government subsidies. Revenues are generated from ticket sales and the food and beverage licenses on premise. In 2019, Kuchenhof generated 25 million euros in revenue. In 2020, as a consequence of the 2019 to 2020 coronavirus pandemic and closures to contain it, the park was shut from its scheduled opening day 21st March until its scheduled closing date 10th of May, costing it an estimated 25 million euros in revenues. If you're planning to visit Kuchenhof in the future, these are the details that you need to consider. Kuchenhof is only open for two months in the spring. Saturday 20 March, that's gonna be the opening date and the last day, it will be on Sunday the 9th of May. During the opening period, the Chulip Park is open every day from 8 o'clock in the morning to half past 7 in the evening. The Flower Park is open every day during the opening period from March 20 to May 9. So also on Sundays and holidays. The flowers in Kuchenhof are heavily dependent on the weather. During the planting, crocuses, daffodils, hyacinths and early tulips are planted for flowering at the beginning of the season. Other flowers bloom later in the season such as the larger tulips. The pavilions have intriguing flower shows from the first to the last day of opening. Of course, you can enjoy all the beauty for a whole day. But on average, a visit to the flower gardens takes about two to four hours. You can bring your own food and drinks. Yes, it's not going to be a problem if you're going to bring your own drinks and food. Because there is a picnic meadow and various benches throughout the park where you can sit down to eat. However, taking your own food into the restaurants is prohibited. The Flower Parade in 2021 or 2021 Blumen Corso will take place on Saturday, 17th of April. Kuchenhof Gardens is a wheelchair-friendly place. The gardens offer excellent access for electric wheelchairs and has plenty of disabled toilet facilities. The use of a wheelchair is free of charge. Use of electric wheelchairs is allowed but not available for rent by the gardens. Where can you buy tickets for Kuchenhof in 2021? In 2021, you will have to buy your tickets online. There is no ticket sale at the entrance of the Flower Park. If you want to visit on a specific day and time, the management strongly advise you to buy your tickets on time. If you also want transportation to Kuchenhof, you can buy a combi ticket with a return bus ticket from different cities nearby the park. When you order online, you can show the tickets on your smartphone so you don't have to print your tickets. Kuchenhof Gardens will work with a maximum number of visitors per day in 2021. When booking your tickets, you must select a day and time slot for entering the park. Individual tickets will go on sale in November 2020. And for the ticket costs, Kuchenhof or Kuchenhof Skip the Line adult ticket is worth 19 euros, while kids' ticket uh, be, um, between 4 to 17 years old is 9 euros. Kids up to three years old go free. And for the parking ticket, it's six euros. Unfortunately, Kuchenhof do not have a cancellation policy. Tickets will therefore not be refunded if you cannot make it on the date.
Entrance tickets can simply be scanned from your mobile phone. You do not have to print your tickets. Cooking of tickets are normally valid on a day of your choice during the opening season due to COVID-19. Tickets for the 2021 season may have to be purchased by date and you have therefore reserved a day. Charging stations for electric cars are available in the car park outside the main entrance. You can ask the traffic steward where they are when you drive onto the side. The charging stations for electric bikes can be found both at the Hof Dingang main entrance and Ingang Extra. There are bike parking facilities at both entrances to the park. You can park your bike there for free. The flower park is close to Amsterdam Airport. There are a number of food outlets in the park. The various restaurants all have their own theme. The park consists of many gardens and four pavilions where the whole history and tradition of tulip cultivation in the Netherlands. The best time to visit the park is from the middle of March till the end of May when the flowers are in full blossom. In the park, there is a fantastic collection of tulips, hyacinths, daffodils, orchids, roses, carnations, lilies and many other flowers. You will be overwhelmed by a spectacle of colors and perfumes. Exhibitors participating in the decoration of the garden Kuchenhof or Kuchenhof are part of Dutch manufacturers that are currently around 90. Every manufacturer is granted a defined area for decoration. These areas are with different flower arrangements. That is why there is no corner that is similar to another. Kuchenhof is one of the major tourist attractions in the Netherlands and annually attracts about 800,000 visitors from around the world or it could be million or more than that. Theme of this year's exhibition Van Gogh 125 years of inspiration. The topic of the exhibition this year is Van Gogh 125 years of inspiration. Okay, yan po kaya sobrang ganda po ng Kuchenhof. For those that want to see the beautiful flower arrangement also can visit the observatory within the palace where the view and the experience is unforgettable. At sana'y nasiyahan kayo sa travel na ito. Maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong patuloy na pagsuporta at pagpapakita ng inyong pagmamahal. Hanggang sa susunod po, ako po ang inyong lingkod, June Degamon of the June Degamon Show or DJ DS. Para sa DJ DS Travel Episode.